So one of the most common statements or comments I see on some of our stability drill exercises, uh, we sometimes refer to them as controlled chaos exercises, where there's numerous handlers, numerous dogs, all moving around, uh, sometimes circling, sometimes approaching, sometimes weaving back and forth through other dogs, is people will say something like, this is just a bite waiting to happen. And while in dog training, that can always occur because dogs are dogs and dogs can bite. In 12 years of doing this full time and 20 years of training dogs uh, pretty actively, uh, I have had zero serious dog bites ever occur in these exercises. Now, do we occasionally have a dog fail? Occasionally, um, but all of the dogs that are doing these jobs and doing this work have to start on the outside of these circles or if we're weaving back and forth between uh, other dogs, we'll create more space if we have a dog that's new or a dog that has not yet proven itself. And then as that dog proves itself at wider gaps or as it proves itself walking at a farther distance around, it's able to slowly and incrementally move a little bit closer and a little bit closer or we get a little bit closer together so that the weaving back and forth is a little bit tighter and we continue this exercise and if the dog has any issues the dog gets corrected we back up a step and we do the dog at the distances that it's able to accomplish without having any issues and then we begin slowly moving those distances closer and closer in also if i have two dogs that i know are potential uh, for having any issues together i step in close on those dogs so that i can very quickly end any kind of fights that occur so if your trainer is not properly preparing for these exercises, they can certainly be dangerous. But if you go through the steps to make sure that all the dogs doing these exercises are prepared for them when they do them, then there's minimal risk and a lot of benefit in stability and obedience to being able to do what we call controlled chaos exercises.